I'm super excited to bring you the Seller Systems Inner Circle exclusive software, Data Dive. Hey everybody, I just wanted to take two minutes and run through exactly uh, what Data Dive can do uh, for you and your business. Uh, whether you are a uh, individual brand owner, a brand new seller, never sold on Amazon before, or whether you're a giant company looking to buy other companies that you want to analyze and dig a little deeper into, uh, I wanted to show you what a master keyword list does. Uh, I know some other um, people out there have started to you know, steal what we had put together years ago and been using, and that's fine, uh, but we've taken it to another level. And our software pulls this data in literally minutes instead of hours of research. So it can speed up your workflow. It can help you make decisions faster. Uh, and and more. So let me share my screen and dive a little bit deeper into the software. Okay, so what you're seeing here is a master keyword list. Uh, this is something that we've been putting together for a couple of years now, where we will download all of this data from Helium 10. And what we're downloading initially is each individual ASIN and all of the keywords that they are indexed for. Now we know that all of the keywords that they are indexed for doesn't mean that those are all the keywords that drive sales for that product. So we've come up with a way to assign a relevancy to each keyword and to understand whether it can actually drive sales for the product. Now, what we identified very early on is that each product may or may not be good at ranking or ranked well for each keyword that drives sales for that type of product. As a matter of fact, what we find is that most sellers on Amazon are bad at ranking, fi either finding and then ranking for most of those keywords. So what this product does and what uh, Master Keyword List does is it takes the data from 10 or more of the best sellers and then aggregates them all together so that we can get a full picture of all of the keywords, you know, or the majority, 98, 95% of all the keywords that drive sales for that product, and then find out how good the competitors are at ranking for them. So some of the data that we're seeing is percentage of keywords uh, that a product might be listed for on page one. Uh, and then we're seeing the percentage of search volume where they're ranked in the top 45 or page one. And so there's a difference between the two. There might be a thousand good keywords. In this case, there are 259 keywords with at least 350 search volume and a relevancy of three. That means at least three competitors are ranked on the first page or top 45. And um, this guy is on 69% of those, but 78% of the search volume. So they found more of the more important ones. This would qualify them as good, but they're on the border of being very good. This is obviously J DJI and a drone, and I don't recommend selling drones on Amazon. It's a super competitive space and it's dominated, uh, but we're able to see that here through the data. We've got another seller here, Hollystone. They're on 84% of the search volume uh, on page one. And uh, you've got a Derek, 65%, and DJI again at 72. And so this data, once we go through this master keyword list, we've actually cleaned this up a little bit because we've removed keywords that we don't think we can get sales from. And we haven't done it completely. I would probably continue to, to remove like Tom's on. And you can see that I've excluded these phrases, nano, pocket, handheld, hand, DJI. These are keywords, uh, phrases for keywords that are not related to the type of drone that I'm analyzing. So I've removed them to make this data more accurate. And so it's giving me a better picture. Now, in addition to that, I'm able to see the sales and revenue from, uh, from the competitors. I'm able to see what price they're selling at. I'm able to see their review count. And if I want to go deeper, the software will also pull uh, some search volume data from Google, uh, some search volume data from Amazon and give me a trend. So is this a product that's more popular or less popular? And it looks like it spiked as uh, spring came around, people were opening back up. And so drones got very popular. And so if I scroll down, I'm actually going to get a very deep dive into each competitor. I'm going to see the, uh, the content that they have. I'm going to see the number of variations. Uh, I'm going to see other spikes here as well from uh, you know a sales perspective. Uh, seven day moving average is marked as well. Again, content, pictures, 
uh, price point, reviews. I'm really getting a good deep dive here and to understand how good my competitors are. We also do uh, some really cool stuff with regards to analyzing how good uh, they are at writing their title and optimizing based on you know match types. So we give them an actual score. We let you write the listing and uh, compare that score. But ultimately, I just really wanted to show you really quickly what a master keyword list looks like and the fact that we can pull all of this data in only a matter of minutes to save your team a significant amount of time with making a decision on whether you should do a product, how to optimize a product, how good your product is against the competition, whether you're missing keywords, how much opportunity is left in a product uh, you know, that you might be thinking about either starting, buying, uh, or acquiring. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. We've also got PPC tools, we've got uh, the optimization tools, uh, and we've got a lot more being developed. So uh, Data Dive is uh, the most powerful tool for Amazon sellers for a reason. And if you're not already using it, make sure you reach out and figure out how to do that. I'll talk to you soon.